In this video, I want to show you how to do System Restore or System Restore in Safe Mode for Windows 10, Windows 8, or 8.1. It is a little bit different than Windows 7 or XP or Vista. If you if you want to do it in your operate system and for whatever reason you can do it in your operate system, uh, what you want to do is while you're in the operate system of Windows 10 or 8.1, go to the bottom left where you have the search there and just type recovery. And then you'll see there on the top there's a, a place that you can click on recovery and then that will give you uh, a, a place where you can go into system restore and safe mode. And I'll show you that later in this video. Now, if you're having an issue doing that and you want to do it in safe mode uh, where you start up your computer and you get into it, I'll go ahead and show you that now. So if you've tried to do a system restore in the uh, Windows operating system um, and it will not let you for whatever reason, you might have a Trojan horse or a virus or something like that, and of course you're trying to back it up to a day before today, before you got the issue, I want to go ahead and start doing it. We want to do system restore in safe mode. And this is for Windows 10 or Windows 8. And, for, and, and again, every operating system is going to be different depending on the kind of computer you have. And what I mean by that is HP, Toshiba, Gateway, Acer, Alienware, Lenovo, Asus, Acer, you know, Acer Aspire, MSI. So there's multiple different PCs and then multiple, um, the computers will have different things that you need to access on your keyboard in order to get into safe mode. If you just want to start out immediately and see if you can get into it, um, on the keyboard here I can show you F8 is a lot of times the, is a sure thing on all computers rather you know for PCs. So you just basically tap F8 when you when you turn it on immediately and it should access it should access your recovery. If not, I'll go ahead and put right now, I'll put quickly a link right now in the video that shows you to do the recovery. And of course with recovery, that's how you get into safe mode. Go ahead and turn on the computer now. This is an HP computer. So for the HP, it's actually going to be F11. There we go. F11 for HP. All right, now it's saying please wait. So that's a good sign. Um, Toshiba, so it'll have like a recovery bar down here, where it'll have like a bar say Windows is loading. Uh, they'll all have different things. Hopefully you got your computer and your operating system backed up on a USB drive, like a 16 to 32 gig gigabyte USB drive. For whatever reason, once you solve the issue that you have now, go ahead and do that because if your hard drive goes bad, then you don't have your operating system anymore. And with Windows 8 and Windows 10, it's much more difficult to, re to restore your um, computer. Okay, what you're going to do is you're going to choose Advanced Options. And of course it gives us system restore is what we're going to do. Use a restore point recording on your PC to restore Windows. And then what you're going to do here is choose your account. Just click it. And then you want to enter your password. And right here it's saying restore system files and settings. Click next. And I got two um, places I can back up from. This one is from a month ago, and this one is from a couple of weeks ago. And so, what you want to do is find a date, and you might have more restore points. You want to find the date that happens or occurs before you had the issue with your computer. So, for example, if today or this week you had the issue, and we're October the 1st, let's say. You want to choose to back up to restore point in September. Or even if it's a even if it's six months or a year before, if that's the only option you got, you can go ahead and do that. And then what we do is we click next. And 
and then usually what you do is you just click finish and it's going to restore it back to that date and it usually takes anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes okay if for whatever reason this does not work uh, I've been told that people have had it hang like on 50 percent it won't go any further um, you might have to actually do a full factory restore and I showed you that and I could show you this right here um, in the recovery you basically access it through the same uh, links that I just showed you a few minutes ago and you just do a full recovery instead of doing in the same place for the recovery mode that you do um, that you do a system restore alright if you have any questions put it in the comment section and um, I hope I helped you thank you